Hello and welcome to chapter 35 of the video tutorial how to set up an online shop with Dreamweaver and PHP. Well, this is the last chapter of the, of the first subscription. Uh, it completes the block that runs from chapter 26 to chapter 35. Uh, so let's continue from, from the point in which we stopped. Okay, we were doing the stock control stuff and adding a field. Well, we have almost finished this in the previous chapter, so I will write done here. There we have it. And let's finish the stock control. Just remind you that we had created in the administration area a new field where the products are. And there we could check the stock. The, th the things that I've just realized of, of one thing you have probably seen too. And it's that when I click on edit, I don't get the stock as such. So I go to products edit here. Products edit. It's open since the last time. This happens because we are not passing in it the, the value of uh, the value it should have when it opens. For example, look here in SEO. It's placing an echo value here. All this string of text, HTML entities, is a function that turns the characters into the ISO 88591, but basically it's checking the value from here, from data product, okay? Data product that comes from the select here, select product, okay? Fine. Uh, so let's take this as an as an example, uh, which is the most practical thing we can do. We take this thing here and we go to stock. Here we don't have the value, so we will put it here, initial value, this one here, and it will be int stock. I save, there it is. You can see product list there we have a 24 etc. Fine, to complete the rest of products we've got in stock uh, let's go to the database. It's a table product and and here you will see that we only get those we put. I will put zero to the rest, okay? Uh, fine, with this we have done it faster than going to administration and, we've, and if we have access to the database obviously it's much easier doing it this way, the rough, the rough way. Right, regarding the front end, we've got our products here, and what we will do is, uh, in each of these items, we will display if it's got a stock or 